Have you ever had one of those weeks where you cannot remember what you've done because you've been so busy that when you've done something, you move on to the next thing, then you move on to the next thing, then you move on to the next thing, then you move on to the next thing. You feel like you haven't really done stuff, but you've done a whole lot of things. That's been my week. Plus, we're setting up the new uh, house, so we're getting furniture in, painting rooms, and I'm setting up my little studio here as well. And then, oh, someone's knocking at the door. Let's go and have a look, see. Funny feeling I know what these are, so I'm going to move the setup. I'm going to put it onto the tabletop so we can see what they are. Right, got a funny feeling I know what this is. Boom, and I'm videoing now on the uh, Fuji XT2, so it's the first time I'm actually filming on it. So we should hopefully see what the quality is like and how this. Um, how this vlog might expand a little bit more, but uh, anyway, let's move on to the unveiling. Start off with a small box. Uh, so basically, I've been I've been filming all these. I get out. Of here. So, Rudy, it's the Rudy Micro. Uh, it's the microphone basically for the uh, for the cameras. I, I've been filming, whenever I've been doing these filming or I've been filming in studios and stuff like that, I usually have my phone a little bit off camera and you will see here, boop, or here, boop, um, what I usually do when I will start a, when I, as soon as I start a video I clap my hands so then at least then that recording and that recording will have a sound wave so I can pick that up and put it into place. I wanted something that will be a little bit easier, so I won't be placing it up, so... Oh, it's got the old uh, dead cat in the front. Little muffler for the wind. Wow, that's actually good quality. I thought it was going to be really tacky. I'm going to have to, obviously... I've uh, finally got to uh, figure out how to work it, so I'm going to now swap from the phone recording to the recording on here. I ended up buying some little extra things just because I do like obviously owning cameras but I also wanted some cameras that were just a little bit more user friendly. I wasn't too worried about losing it, using it. I want to use it all the time but I want it to have the same quality as this. I think you can kind of get where I'm going from. Coming from. Man, they packed that well. A few moments later. So I've gone for the uh, XT20 with the 18 to 55, 2.8 to 4. It's, uh, it's going to be mainly for like when I'm walking around and I don't want to have cameras. Since I've got my friend's wedding next month, so I'm going to take it. I'm an usher, so I don't want to be taking all the, the photos and stuff and being worried too much about it. So I want a lens that's got the variable focal length, and I want a camera that's small enough but has the quality. Again. Spec wise, I'm not going to go through all the specs, but here we go. Let's have a little gander. Lenses. Have a little look. Oh, still nice, still nice. And this has got the image stabilizer on as well, so I'm mainly going to be using this camera for doing any videos, like behind the scenes stuff or anything like that, as well. White box this time. Oh. The uh, clips for the side to put the uh, strap on. Cable. Right. Change angle. So, like I mentioned before. This camera is mainly for use of, because it's so small, but it's still got the 24 megas, same as this. So it's basically the same sensor in this, they're in the uh, Fuji X-T2. So let's just have a little look. 
So this is actually the first time I'm actually holding one of these myself. I played around with the uh, Fuji T2 when I was in the shop before I got it, so yeah. It's nice. That's it with the lens. Nice. So obviously it's missing the dials on the top, this is different from the X-T2. You've got the shutter speed there, you've got the aperture ring on your lenses like normal. But the, the big difference is obviously you don't get the ISO dial here. And I don't think, I mean you don't have the joystick but it's a touch screen sensor. There's not... Oh it's lightning fast. Oh, it's a different shutter sound though. It's a little bit more wispy than the... Oh, it still, it still shoots fast. Oh, that's great. I mean, we'll check it out. I'll have to check out the other features on it and stuff like that and get back to you, but... Actually... weekend so let's go camping. I'm going to check out see where there's good places in Yorkshire to go. I've always wanted to drive up to the Yorkshire Dales, camp somewhere on a cove. Let's have a little look. An hour and 15 minutes away from me. Bob on. So what this will mean now then is I'll go camping tomorrow, I'll take the Fuji, I'll take the X-T2, I'll take the new microphone with the dead cat, see how good that is, I'm guessing we're in England, it's in the Yorkshire Dales, it's going to be windy, it's probably going to be crappy weather, so we'll see how we go from there, and uh, yeah, I've never really done it myself, like gone camping by myself, but you know, what's the harm? I mean, I'm not doing anything this weekend. I've had a busy week, so relaxing time, camping somewhere pretty good. Let's go. It's like freezing outside. It's 